Joanne, as you know, senior citizens have a great deal of political clout, especially if they unite over one particular issue. It's not just the name of this rally. It's not fair is also the message hundreds of retirees are sending to the governor and the legislature. They're angry about Rick Snyder's proposal to put a tax on pensions of those collecting over $40,000 a year. If he wants to bring the gas down and uh, the price of food down, I'll be glad to live on 40000 but until then, uh, I can't live. Middle class isn't getting any of our fair share. And it's time the middle class and the retirees stood up. And I'm 62 and she's 87. This is the first protest we've ever gone to. We feel like we should have to pay tax on our pension. Why not? Because it's something that we work for. And we worked hard for this. They didn't give us nothing. And half the stuff that we got, they taken it away from us. AARP jumped on the bandwagon after Mary Lee Woodward created a Facebook page calling for this protest. Now she'll continue to use the social network to broaden her grassroots crusade. What I've been telling my Facebook people is to copy the flyers that I have about these issues and to pass them out to nursing homes and uh, other places because we know that there are a lot of uh, seniors that don't have access to computers or the internet. Meantime, AARP will flex its political muscle. We'll have our lobbyists working with the legislature and the governor's office to try to come up with a plan that we see uh, that is more fair and balanced than a plan that, that, that taxes seniors and the working poor and shifts the burden of taxation onto them and away from business. The protest lasted about two hours. It was very peaceful and very organized. But throughout the day, we have noticed a lot of smaller groups of protesters who were a lot less organized. And uh, tomorrow we're hearing that there could be another big protest. It seems like it's going to be a busy week here at the Capitol.